Hi Knife fans, thought I'd just do a quick video on my replica LSS1, a life support system 1. This was originally a Jack Crane knife, first seen in a TV series called Airwolf and then later in the movie Commando. It's not 100% um, accurate because the choil's too big and there's a few other inaccuracies on it, but anyway, it is what it is. Um, this knife project is a real budget build. It's like about 80 bucks because I had all the materials at home. The only material I had to buy was the steel and the steel is 9CR18MOV which apparently is uh, like a knockoff, a Chinese knockoff of 440C. Um, I'm impressed with it. It arrived hardened, um, HRC of 59 and I've kept it cold while I'm working while working it and it's um, I've taken this thing out and hacked in some pretty hard wood and has not um, deformed the edge or chipped it or any way shape or form so I'm pretty happy with it um, just displaying it here in my aliens collection because I think it actually works well in this universe um, finished it off with a sheath this is not a leather sheath it's just vegan leather but I did stitch it, and it's not even, it's actually uh, like a plastic insert, just with a cover on the front, so it just looks nice, uh, with the stitching all the way around. The knife has got 9 inch blade, and quarter inch guard, and then the, roughly is like 5 and 3 quarter inch handle. It's a f hidden tang, um, but it's not full tang unfortunately because the piece of steel was only 300 mil long or 12 inches long so the end of the tang comes to about there and then I've filled it up with other stuff what I did in this one was um, a composite of uh, aluminium dr drill chips and epoxy so it's pretty strong as I said I've hacked in some pretty hard wood with this I've got some um, rail sleepers and other bits out in the yard and it um, it didn't break so um, I'm going to say that's a success. It's um, sharp enough to do the job. And you'll be able to see this. Yeah, good enough. Good enough to do the job. Um, is it hair splitting? No, probably not. But who cares? It's uh, It'll cut paper, it'll shave hair. It's good enough. I'm not an expert um, knife sharpener anyway. A bit cheap. I actually use this thing to put the final edge on it. So this is a little cheapy out of eBay, ten bucks. And uh, yeah, I actually found that on another video where a guy was um, had bought replica Rambo knives that were sharp out of the box, and he used them and he got it, made them blunt and he couldn't get the edge back on them. And that's what he bought one of these and his little sharpeners and. Uh, so I had success with that, so I decided to copy, and it works, and uh, this pouch I just found at a camping store, it was a bit of a weird shape pouch, but it just fits this tool perfectly, so um, good from that. So there it is, the, uh, this knife, um, the finish on it is just, um, like it's a matte grey, I've used, I didn't sandblast it, I just, because um, I don't have access to that sort of gear, so I just use a, um, it's basically a putty, spray, spray, uh, spray putty filler, primer, if you will, um, it seems to be pretty robust after about 24 hours, so, um, yeah, it's worked out okay, so it's, uh, it's got a few imperfections, but I don't really care, I like it, it's come up better than I thought it was going to, and for the money that I've spent on it, super happy with the job. So I'll wrap it up for there, for now, thanks for watching.